an ABC News Brief, brought to you by Kentucky Fried Chicken. Now from New York, Stephen Gear. Good afternoon. The White House is now acknowledging that mistakes were made in the Iran affair. Presidential spokesman Larry Speaks says there were mistakes in the implementation of the secret arms sale to Iran and in the diversion of funds to the Contras. Speaks also admitted that the scandal has hurt President Reagan's credibility, but he predicted that public confidence will be restored as more information about the White House's handling of the scandal comes out. Speaks confirmed rumors that began weeks ago that he is resigning his post in February to work for Merrill Lynch. President Reagan told reporters he'll allow his cabinet officers to decide for themselves whether they will take the Fifth Amendment when they're called before the Senate committee investigating the Iran scandal. Both former National Security Advisor John Poindexter and his aide Oliver North took the Fifth when they appeared before the panel. North told reporters today he does not think he has been uncooperative and says he's willing to talk in the appropriate forum. Now this. Honeywell has joined the list of companies leaving South Africa. Honeywell will sell its South African subsidiary to local investors. That's News Brief. I'm Stephen Gere. More later on World News Tonight with Peter Jennings in Washington.